Yarn over tea. Hello everyone, welcome to Yarn Over Tea. So today this is our first video and I want to just do a small brief introduction of what's happening or what this channel is all about. Basically what we do here is slow TV yarn style. We're going to be working on our yarn projects very slowly as we're just talking about life. Um, we ask the big questions. If any of you want to join, feel free to do so. Leave a comment below. Subscribe. It's not mandatory. You know, everything is up to your choice and your decision. So if you want to participate, you can. If you don't, no hard feelings. So... What I'm working on right now is, uh, it's a very personalized, what do you call it, a reusable pouch for, um, for plastic bags. You know, the plastic bags that you get from the grocery store and it's still in good condition so you want to reuse it. Well, I looked on Amazon and I saw that people make these fabric things to hang in, in the kitchen it was like 20 bucks a pop. So I wasn't gonna do that since I have so much yarn left over. So I thought I'd make one. But as you can see, um, it's a little too big. But oh well, I do have a lot of plastic bags, so it could work. It'd just be like a really long tube. It's pretty much a long tube with a hole at the bottom to dish out the plastic bags. And then it'll be very long, and then I'll have handles to just hang it on a hook or something. You know, not not super pretty, but it's very simple to make. So I have this hole here for the uh, the plastic bags to come out, and then I'm now making the tube, which is now starting to look like a hat, but. I may have increased too much over here. As you can see, it's not as smooth. But then again, who cares? It's for the kitchen, and it's practical, and it's useful. So that's just what I'm going to do. I have a lot of cordial yarn left, and that's what I'm using it for. So what are you working on? What's your project? And how is that going? Any key takeaways that you have learned or something that we can all learn from. So moving on to the next section of this video is answering a big question. What I mean by big question is it's not just how are you and then the answer is fine. That is not a big question and it's not a big answer. Well, a big question means to dig a little bit more deeply and provoke some thoughtful ideas in your head. For example, what was the highlight of your weekend? So that's a big question because most of the time when you ask about a person's weekend, they say, oh, it's good. We had fun. You know, they don't go into any detail. But if it's a guiding question that helps provoke um, some kind of thing that they should look out for, it helps a person answer more deeply. So today's question was, is how, what was the highlight of your weekend instead of how did your weekend go? So my highlight of the weekend is that we baptized my daughter in Florida. We were in Jacksonville, Florida, but it was a little breezy and rainy, but it was all good because I really enjoyed the family time. We spent time with the in-laws, and she was such a good baby. She smiled throughout the whole baptism, and, you know, those those kind of things can be very dull and boring for a baby, but she did very well. So my highlight of the weekend was to spend time with the family. We had a wonderful baptism. 
uh, my key takeaway is if I do a quick trip for an event like that, I think I'm going to have to do a four or five days kind of thing. Um, I just cannot do a quick weekender trip anymore. My body does not heal the same way. I have to spend so many days to recuperate my energy level back. It was just really rough on my body here and, and our lack of sleep. My my four-month-old did not like that. So as you can see, I we ask a big question every day. And we try to have some thought-provoking answer. And if you want to answer, feel free to go to the level of your comfort, which means you don't have to tell us the details, you, all of the details of your life. You don't need to do that. You just answer to the question and give a little bit of thought into it. Whatever detail you want to put in or leave out, it's all up to you. Every day we'll answer a question, and today is our day number one, so feel free to comment below or send me a note, you know, ask the answer to your question, and once in a while, we may have your answers shown on this channel, of course, with your permission, everything is consensual here. No one's forcing you to do anything that you don't want to do. And we'll just kind of go from there. This is to help us become more authentic with ourselves and to perfectly align with everything that we're doing in our life, in our thoughts, in the way that we talk. We want to make sure that we are living as ourselves and everyone is accepted for who they are here. Um, I do have to lay out some standards and rules here. So those that do not follow the guidelines of this channel, uh, they will be banned from the channel and comments will be deleted. So we're gonna keep a good eye on any of these things. We wanna make sure that everybody feels welcomed here. And again, participation and how much you participate is to your own discretion. So make sure that you know your rights as what you say on the internet, remains on the internet. And uh, please make sure that you are keeping yourself it, outside of harm's way and protecting your privacy as you are able to do so. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment below. I will be going through the channel to answer any questions. I know the first few videos will probably be introductions because it is a good amount of um, what is a culture change for some that they might not be used to. So I'm thinking we're just going to ease into it, nothing too deep, nothing too complex. And then as the channel matures, we might have bigger and deeper questions. Um, of course, if you don't want to do anything, please don't. Uh, you're not obligated. But I hope that you do join us and have some very nice slow TV, slow yarn time to relax your mind and just to have something, somebody to chat with. I think that's the real key here is having a community that you really feel accepted is very hard to find. So we want to make sure that this channel is kept to its purpose and that everyone who participates will continue to participate as they feel that this is the right channel for them. I hope everyone have a wonderful day. And if you need anything, feel free to reach out. I would love to connect with any and every one of you. Thank you so much for your time. Bye. Thank you for watching.